Alrighty, going on the seventh day of my shoulder pain and stiffness. I've been lifting it way more today. I don't know why I stopped lifting my shoulder. Like, I guess I was scared of the pain and I was scared it was gonna pop and gonna hurt something more, but I shouldn't have stopped like moving it around because it got super stiff. It's been seven days. I've been moving it like a lot today. And yeah, I have to move it this slow because it hurts that bad, but I can move it to about right there that's when the pain kicks in and it's like in the back of my shoulder kind of it's like like right in my trap and in the back close to my shoulder blade I don't know what's wrong I did a test on YouTube shoulder test to see where the pain was and I got closest to a shoulder impediment right, but sorry if I look rough I haven't taken a shower today but anyways closest thing I got to was a shoulder impediment. It's also called swimmer's shoulder and it's where shoulder pain caused by connective tissue is rubbing on your shoulder blade. So that's might what it may be, but we're not doctors. We don't know. So it could be anything. Like right now, after I took a shower and used it a bunch and started lifting it, it feels like my whole shoulder is falling off my body from from like all of this down it feels like it's falling off and it's so it aches and it's sharp pain and it's like very uncomfortable I just moved my left arm outwards for the first time yeah it's laying on the bed it has to be stabilized when it's outwards or else it'll hurt but anyways I know this looks like my right arm but my camera is flipped backwards this is actually my left arm but this is the first time I moved it outwards like this in eight days. Literally eight days. And this feels great. I felt like the Tin Man when they unrusted him on the Wizard of Oz. I was like, with the sweet tea. It's almost doctor time. We are at the drive through the McDonald's. No, man, that's all. Brandon and Mama getting food. I'm charging Thanks. coffee. Like usual. So I got a shot in my right arm. Hurts super bad. Meningitis. Oh, it hurts worse than what are those shots that hurt really bad? That was. So we let so much shit pile up at once that I have like 17 doctor appointments now. I got a poop doctor. I got a counselor. I got anxiety. I got a, what a heart cardio cardiologist I have to go to. So dermatology. So much shit, man. All right, I have to mix this much stuff for to. It's gonna make me blow shit everywhere with 64 ounces of water. So I have to drink all of this, and I'm gonna be pooping for days straight. It's like a colonoscopy. Oh, first cup down. I got this much left. Um, I feel drunk from that meningitis shot, but I don't know if it's from that or I'm just like drunk. I didn't drink any alcohol, but anyways, I've got like. How many more cups? I've seven more cups of this to go, and then I will be pooping all over the place. All right, huge update. Uh, it is 2 a.m. I am still on the toilet. This is literally probably my 28th time pooping. The light bulb went out, so now all I have is this light. So I have to keep this door open. Sometimes I can't even make it to shut that door. So people just like walk by and watch me poop everywhere. <laughs> this is not a fun experience. But anyways, hope you guys enjoy. Keep watching and subscribe.